This press release just came across my desk. Let me read it for you. This is coming from the Department of Linguistic Policing Against Toxic Masculinity. In the pursuit of a just and inclusive society, free of gender stereotypes, fixed binaries, and biological essentialism, we strongly recommend that all university members, staff, students, and professors alike stop using words that are associated with toxic masculinity and replace these with more balanced, gender-free terms. Banned words include, but are not limited to, ambition, strength, ruggedness, virility, risk-taking, physicality, athleticism, masculinity, muscularity, boldness, bravery, gallantry, courage, manliness, resoluteness, and robustness. All of these words should now be replaced with one word and its grammatical variants, estrogenful. Let us give you a few examples in case you don't know how to make the translation. Example one. Here's an example of what now would be considered toxic language. John is a highly ambitious man who exhibits great courage. The new proper form, John is a highly estrogenful non-woman who exhibits who exhibits great <laughs> estrogenfulness. Example two, toxic form. Oh my goodness, look at John's muscles. He's so rugged. Proper form. Oh my goodness, look at John's hard estrogens. He is so estrogenized. Example three, toxic form. As a woman, I'm sexually aroused by masculine men. The proper new form. As a woman, I'm sexually aroused by estrogenful non-women. Through the use of gender-neutral terms, we will fight against the perpetuation of antiquated gender st stereotypes that serve to spread toxic masculinity. Do your part and support a gender-free society where masculinity is eradicated. Do your part, folks. Have a good Sunday. Cheers.